Hey everybody and welcome once again to the Poindexter Lounge, or as we like to call it, another episode of The Incredible Shrinking Man. All of my clothes are getting so big. If you're new to the channel, I have lost 102 pounds since November and uh, Tiff, I'm having a hard time uh, keeping my clothes on. Sounds like a good problem to have. Well, Ask any woman. Yeah, well, problem for you, but no, good problem for you, but probably not for our viewers out there. It's not that kind of channel. Uh, but, uh, hey, maybe we should start a GoFundMe or a Patreon for uh, people to uh, give us money to keep me in clothes. Hey, welcome to the Poindexter Lounge. Uh, it is so good to have you. If this is your first time, we're just so glad that you are here. Uh, this is a place for who, Tiff? A place for nerds. A place for nerds. That's right, like you and like me. And uh, we just love to talk about stuff here on the channel, stuff that we love about comic books and games and TV shows and movies and all that good stuff. And uh, so my name is Enosh, a.k.a. Enosh Fett, along with the lovely... Tiptastic. Yes, of Themyscira. <laughs> yes, she is an Amazon goddess, and I love her so. I wish I was that tall. Yes. Well, hey, guys, it is good to have you. If you haven't noticed, we didn't change the set from the last video that we did, but I did add a Wonder Woman right here uh, for your viewing pleasure. <laughs> <laughs> hey, today we are talking about uh, a picture that came out this week of Kristen Wiig mm -hmm. as uh, Cheetah. And she's not Cheetah. Not yet. In the picture, but uh, it's a little taste. It's just just a little little taste Tiffany yes what did you think when you saw this picture well I thought she kind of was getting that nerd vibe from seeing her in uh back in you know Ghostbusters when she had the glasses and everything but it looks like it's a crossover yeah <laughs> but it looks like something from the 80s because she's got the big bulky sweater she's got the long skirt with the white leggings and you know the the frizzy hair but it looks like it's something that could you know be very very cool to see where it goes from there and how she turns into him yeah i you know um i'll be honest with you when i first saw it i was like hmm. eh, that's it uh okay but you know i love the fact that they put a little taste in there like she's in a room it looks kind of like a museum or something like that with a bunch of animals you know stuffed animals and stuff like that and yeah. so it'll be interesting maybe i she, am maybe she was at chuck testa's chuck testa <laughs> There is a reference for you folks. Go look up Rhett and Link, Chuck Testa. Yeah. You're welcome. Is, is that Cheetah in our room? <laughs> nope, just Chuck Testa. <laughs> He's a taxidermist. Made yes. a funny commercial. Okay, so um, look it up on YouTube, kids. I'll, you know, I'll put a link in the description to Chuck <laughs> Testa. There you go. Um, so, Tiff, you love the first Wonder Woman. Yes. I love the much. first Wonder Woman. What did you love about the first Wonder Woman? I loved that we got to see, you know, you got a taste of it in, what was it, Batman versus Superman. We got to see a yeah. little, a couple little things here and there in the picture. It made you wonder where it came from. But it's also one of those things that I just loved seeing Themyscira, seeing the Amazons and how they trained and for battle and everything. But I also loved seeing the little things when she came back over to America, like the taste of ice cream and just, you know, the things that were so different from her uh, being on the island. So I, I just loved that, and I just thought it was so stinking cool and kick butt when... You know, you got all these men hiding in a bunker, and she's just like, I got this, takes off her coat and just walks out there and just stops everything. So I thought she was really cool, and it just kind of was a, a, a female empowering movie. Yes. So um, what, are you, what are you hoping to see in this next movie? Well, <laughs> to be honest, I'm hoping to see Steve again. <laughs> I wish Steve. we could. He is. I know. You this, saw the picture? I also There's said two that, pictures that came out. But yes. I also said at the end of that movie, you saw something happen in the sky, but you did not physically see it happen, so anything could happen. Yes. But I would like to see just how the story, you know, goes on from where we ended the first Wonder Woman, and just to see, you know, is she going to get, you know, some bad guys that she's going to fight besides who she did in the first one. Toys are falling in the toy room, yeah. folks. All right. <laughs> keep, oh, I'm sorry. Keep going. <laughs> but it's it's just to see, you know, are they going to tweak her suit a little bit at all? Are we going to see any more of Themyscira? Are the, are the Amazons going to have to come and help her for anything? So mm. I just want to, I'm very excited and interested to see where the story is going to progress from here. Yes. Um, now, you, you mentioned Steve. So Steve mm -hmm. Trevor, there is a picture of Steve Trevor in full. Did Steve tell you that? Yes, Steve told me that. That's a Flight of the Concords reference. Yes, I'm sorry, we're referencing a lot of nerd stuff today. We are digging deep today, man. I will leave you a Flight of the Concords uh, 
link down in I'm the description him as well. Apparently, just by quoting stuff. Apparently, uh, but no. So Steve is is in there, and mm. uh, he's in all eighties get up now. Do you think it's really Steve, or do you think you know in the Wonder Woman show with with Linda Carter, they did just that? You know, the first mm-hmm. season was actually back in what was actually World War II. Mm-hmm. Uh, they they kind of changed it a little bit for this movie, for uh, but. It was in World War II, and she knew Steve Trevor there. And then in the second season, they brought it to modern age. Yep. And it was the, it was it uh, Wagner? I can't remember his uh, his first name. Lyle Wagner, I think it was. Yes, Lyle Wagner, and he played Steve Trevor. Mm-hmm. But in the like, what was it the late seventies, right? Yep. And but it was it was Steve Trevor's grandson, Steve uh. Trevor, who looked identical to Steve Trevor. Do you think that that's what they're going to do here, or do you think that there's some other magical thing that it's the real Steve Tre- Trevor? I don't know. Who's to say, you know, when he was on Themyscira trying to get better that he didn't find or given something that He could was have... in the pool. Exactly. And what if that helped him during the explosion to be like, oh, yeah, I was in that water. I'm okay. <laughs> or if, you know, how do you know if uh, Hippolyta, or however you say her name, Hippolyta, whatever, that she would have given yeah, you him something. you don't ever say a woman. You don't say hippo. And yeah, woman in the same new... Hippolyta. But regardless, maybe he got something, you know, to keep him... Maybe to keep him yeah. safe, to keep her safe. I mean, she can take care of herself, but she knew that, you know... I think it, I think it might be... think for him, so maybe she wanted to keep him safe. I think of maybe dipping in that water, in that pool with that, he, that he so. bathed in, that that may I have done something. I was thinking that, too. So, but it'll be interesting. But we want to know what you think, guys. What is your What are your thoughts about Wonder Woman 2? What do you think about these two pictures? The picture of Kristen Wiig uh, as Cheetah, and also the picture of Steve Trevor. Uh... I just can't. Chris Pine as Steve Trevor. <laughs> uh, I got stuff falling in my room, folks. Yeah. I got I got stuff falling off of shelves that I got to take care of. Dun, dun, dun. Uh, but hey, what do you think, guys, of this of, of this movie? What do you do think? you have other ideas? Things that you think may have happened or not happened to Steve, or other conspiracy theories that you think before this yeah. movie comes out? Let us know down in the comment section because you know what? If this is your first time here, we just want you to know we love to have conversations with people. We love hearing from you in the comment section. You can follow us on uh, at Enosh Music on Twitter and uh, and talk to us there about it. Tell us what you think. Tell us your ideas, your thoughts, your goals, your plans, your life story. We love all of it. And you can also tell us what you'd love to see on the channel because we want to talk about the stuff and that we'll you, you want to talk about. And we'll give you a shout out that it was your idea. That's right. If we talk about the top that you uh that you go with hey we will give you a shout out for sure all right so hey wonder woman 2 is coming out i'm excited I don't i'm know excited about too else, i'm excited I'm too excited. i'm still on board with the dceu man i'll yes. tell you what i'm still there so hey until next time i'm enosh aka enosh fett and along with the lovely tiftastic the tifalita <laughs> tif tif maybe uh anyways She's an Amazon goddess, like I said, <laughs> and I love her very much. Until next time, guys, just remember, if you're flying too low in the ocean, you may run into Themyscira. And people don't come back from there, usually. You said that. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Until next time, bye-bye. <laughs>